Okay, it's 5.30 Saturday afternoon. I'm going to short circuit and then uh, bullet test 160 amp hour iron phosphate cells fully charged to 4.4 volts with a 1200 amp continuous short circuit meter. You recording? Yeah. Try it again. There's not even any grass growing there, I can tell you that. I always shoot high. Did we zoom in, Colin? Yes, I asked him to zoom in. <laughs> I thought it was going to blow up. There's some smoke. Uh, that one's smoking now. The yeah, bullet test one is smoking pretty much, and the uh, short circuit one is starting to heat up quite a bit. They're both kind of hot. So after one, one and a half minutes, roughly. I hope it doesn't blow up. And we'll watch this. I expected the uh, iron phosphate. Uh oh, this isn't good to breathe in. To uh, to actually flame. I think it's venting. The short circuit. Look at that smoke. Just... Joe, it's venting the short circuit. Oh, this stuff isn't good to breathe in, is it? I wish you'd had the hose here.
It's almost five minutes into the test and the wires, uh, double watt wires to that switch are uh, starting to burn. I want to bring this a little closer. Every time I shoot high. That's not good. No. I accidentally hit somebody in the head. <laughs> <laughs> I figure I shoot at their legs and uh, make them dance. How long are you gonna let that uh, short, short circuit for? Until it cools down. Yeah. Is that, is that impressive? Are the wires yeah. smoking? The yeah. wire insulation on the double watt wires, the terminals are uh, heating up on the, the battery. And this time the uh, switch didn't melt apart. What, did, it, did it last time? It, yeah, it melted. It, it, there's so much current, no matter what you do, you can't, you can't handle it. I'm going to get another cell and shoot it, just because I didn't hit that one. 